Julie, Rob, police say the ultimate goal is to save lives and by taking some of the pressure off the homicide unit, the department is already seeing results. Whether it's a homicide or not, Omaha police are working to prevent gun violence like this. Sometimes these victims of those non-fatal shootings are going to be our next homicide suspects and or homicide victims. Lieutenant Keith Williamson is in charge of OPD's gang unit, and he often sees the circle of retaliation. A known gang member gets shot by another rival gang member. There's a good chance that either that person or that person's friends are going to retaliate in some way. It's a cycle the department is trying to break with the creation of a new assault unit. It allows investigators to dive deeper into cases going after known violent criminals before they pick up a gun again. That's where I think with this unit, it's looking at other other ways to go after some of the known suspects that we have other than having somebody testify. Williamson says the unit is already getting results. One of those arrests after someone fired into a home near 13th and Bancroft July 2nd. Officers arrested 18 year old Vershawn Luckett. They say he told them he shot at the house because the people who lived there robbed him. Police say the unit also helped them arrest 31 year old Cooper Cavan. There's no booking photo yet. They believe he wounded a man near 24th and Camden July 31st. Williamson hopes these arrests are just the beginning. That makes the neighborhood feel safer, makes a good arrest. Again, it gets the gun off the street and also solves the problem of getting the person who purchased that gun. OPD stats show there were 16 fewer shootings in 2017 than in 2016 and one less homicide. The department hopes the new assault unit will drive those numbers down even further this year. Back to you.